So I wanted to make a quick video explaining like what's my plan right now because um, I was going to release a video before I started the Bioshock series, but I got lazy and didn't do it. Uh, so right now, the whole Bioshock series is done. Like I have every single episode recorded. I only have one episode left to do, uh, but I'm waiting for one of my uh, favorite music writers to release a song, and then I'm going to use that in the finale. Hopefully it comes out by the time uh, the last episode releases. Um... But obviously, with the ending of uh, Far Cry Season Two, I am—I was missing a main series, and no, Bioshock is not a main series. It's a series I've been meaning to finish for a while. Like you can see that I've been on and off of it in the past. I, I don't remember if I actually remembered to delete the old videos, but if I didn't, I'm most likely going to be too lazy to do it anyways. Um, and I'm trying to. M I'm using it to like experiment with doing a no commentary cinematic thing. Um, it wasn't the best I can do, but I know I want to experiment with that more in the future with uh, voiced games. Like, I'm sure the next Far Cry game is most likely going to be voiced, but if they do, um, actually, I'll talk to that. I'll talk about that in a bit. Um, after or near the end of the Bioshock Infinite series, I will restart the Evil Within 2 because that is the next one I want to experiment with no commentary cinematic. But I'm actually going to get some leeway with this because I want you guys to comment in the comment section if you guys would want to see commentary in the Evil Within um like videos or if you just want me to do it cinematically heavily edited and stuff like that um and of course adding music because uh previously since i was doing commentary a lot of that was uh, missing and i also want to do a better intro because i looking back at it i really hated the intro i had for the evil within uh it was really simplistic like a little bit too much and uh if anything like like i feel like i would just have it so like it just flashed the title screen beginning of every episode um but yeah so just leave for that if you guys want commentary on the evil within and after that i'm thinking of adding an elder scroll series specifically of course skyrim heavily uh like it's going to be modded uh to just overall improve the game and help me um just visually like tell a appealing story so it's not just like something you could play i kind of want there to be stuff like new weapons and stuff to keep you guys like saying "Ooh, that's a nice weapon and shit like that um and but right now my most anticipated series and one that's going to be the main series when it comes out is cyberpunk 2077 i am so fucking excited for that game and it seems like uh we are hopefully getting a reveal this e3 since cyberpunk will be coming to this e3 and most likely to the my uh, the xbox or the microsoft conference because um P playstation is not doing one this year and uh, when it comes out, uh, I'm going to be like either if I can find a way to turn off the commentary, I mean like uh, the voice acting, I'll do my own voice acting for my character. But if not, then I'm going to be more like trying to like be someone who's like telling a story of this person in Night City. Um, and I wanted to talk about my specifically my plans for my character in a separate video or possibly in the podcast that we do in uh, my other channel, um, which I will leave a link to in the description. Hopefully I remember because I've been overwhelmed today and I cannot keep my head straight. Um, also, keep in mind, uh, the next Far Cry game is rumored to come in 2020 and I've been preparing scenarios for all possibilities as I have plans for the Brook Twins uh, from season... Um, season one and two uh to come back in far cry 6 and this is if they're the protect if the protagonist we have is uh voiced in far cry 6 then i'm going to make a reference to the brick twins but of course if we get to make our own protagonists again i'm going to make jason the main protagonist of the next uh far cry season so that is confirmed but i'm saying I'm, I'm i'm not saying the next season actually because i'm planning if we do have a non-voice character and jason is coming back for far cry 6 then um 
I'm going to have it so we have a season that builds up to Far, uh, Far Cry 6. And I'm going to be using the map editor in Far Cry 5 to tell that story. And um, So yeah, I'm hoping for that. But definitely my theory is that in the next game, it's going to be like the bombs never happen. And I'm... And if it did, then most likely the next game is going to take place in Africa or Cuba, since it was referenced in Far Cry 4 that Cuba was a possibility, so we can um, like reintroduce us to the Gunrunner in that one, or the Warlord, the previous Warlord who turned like into like a priest or some shit. Um, and I think Africa, because South America was untouched by the bombs if the bombs turns out to be canon so that's most likely it and my my plan for jason is that um somehow he his something drives him to south america i don't know what if it is if it's just business or something like that but i'm going to use the story that they're giving us with far cry 6 and the the passions and motivations of jason to kind of form a story if that's a possibility or not i'm also completely fine with there being a voice character since previously with jason brody and um aj gale it was pretty good um i just wish aj gale was more of a featured character because it seemed like more like the world was more focused around uh, than his character while Jason Brody we got to learn about like what brought him to Rook Island everything like that like we we got to know more about Like him as a person and his development than we did AJ Gale It just felt like AJ was like a background character Even though you were playing him and it kind of made the whole vibe of the game kind of off Which is why Far Cry 4 is not my favorite Far Cry and Far Cry 3 Kinda is but I, I say Far Cry 5 is, but it's m probably just because I feel thankful that that actually jump-started my YouTube channel. And um, to be honest, I could fucking keep on having just like 20 views of video and I'll be happy, honestly. At least if I have someone to entertain and I'm hoping I'm doing a really good job and then with entertaining you guys with the new series that are coming out. So yeah, um, leave in the comments if you guys want commentary on uh, The Evil Within. Uh, tell me your opinion on the Bioshock series. Is it good? Is it not? Um, I don't. It it's fine. I just wanted to complete the series so I can get it out of the way. Uh, but I wanted to put passion into it still, so it's not just like uh, he like put no effort. He just wanted to finish. It. Um, I'm always going to try to put effort into my series and even I even have a funny moments videos for certain games uh, that I've been playing with friends so Stay tuned for that, too. They're not going to be like cinematically edited like previously, but they will be pretty uh, edited So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was uh, I'm doing this without a script So that's why I'm stuttering and shit a lot. So uh, I hope I wasn't too bad but yeah i'll see you guys in the next one i'm gonna start um the evil within series after i see feedback but if i don't see any feedback of you guys commenting um uh, commenting if you want commentary on the evil within or not then i'm just going to go with a cinematic route since that was my plan before but if you guys want commentary i will gladly do that instead um but yeah hope you guys enjoy this video and i'll see you guys in our next chapter peace out told us where the easy part begins the story that they sold us keeps us hanging from the end so we'll keep on starting the fires thinking we'll smoke out the liars we don't give up when we're tired that isn't the way that i'm wired All the calm before the fall Lightning when it flashes Tells the story of it all Woo! So we'll keep on starting the fires Thinking we'll smoke up the liars We don't give up when we're tired That isn't the way that I'm wired